Hi and welcome back to High Life Dubai Season 7. Dubai is a dream city for driving the smoothest and snazziest cars. So let's check out the sparkling new Audi A6 which recently made its debut in Dubai. Audi A6, the successor of the world's most successful executive sedan, recently made its market debut in the Middle East with two V6 engines. The design of the new Audi A6 embodies athleticism and elegance. The roomy interior echoes the sinewy style of the exterior. The salient element is the wraparound and inlay encircling the driver and the front seat passenger. Every detail of the interior, including an innovative layered wood veneer is a testament to the care that Audi invests in car making. The A6, it's one of the most important cars for us to become the number one premium brand in the world and also here in the Middle East. In terms of design technology, uh, it's so important for us. It's been specially built for the, for the super hot climate of the GCC and standard is four zone air conditioning and also for the first time MMI, uh, our multimedia interface is now available in Arabic. It's interesting to know that the new Audi A6 is specially developed for the Middle East region. The performance of highly efficient four-zone automatic air conditioning system, for example, has been increased. So if you are looking to buy a powerful yet elegant sedan, go to an Audi showroom and test drive the new A6 now. The Audi car is absolutely fabulous. It performs, it's comfortable, and it's a lot better than my ex-wife. Oh, the Audi is great. It handles well, smooth on water, even smoother on road. Audi is a great car. I have Audi since 10 years um, and every time I'm experiencing more and more its power and its uh, stability on the road. This is the first time I try an Audi and I think it's going to be my next car. A wonderful, very good car. Very. Driving is very comfortable. You feel safe and you, can, you have so many options, I am thrilled, it's perfect. It's just a brilliant car, I have one, I have an A8, this is an A6, just a fantastic car, it drives great, full options, perfect, enjoying it. Audi will become the number one premium automotive manufacturer in the world and also here in the Middle East. In many countries we've already achieved that mantle and here in the Middle East we're well on the way to achieving the remarkable goal. And after that racy launch, let's have our fill of Bollywood before we end tonight's show. The world premiere of one of the most expensive movies in Bollywood in recent times, Azan. Azan is about biological warfare where the central character Azan, which is essayed by Sachin De Joshi, plays an infamant who has to go undercover beyond enemy lines to save the country from a threat of biological warfare. The film has a multi-star cast and was shot at multiple international locations like Morocco, Hong Kong, Algeria, Poland, France, Germany and India. The climax of the film was shot in Chechnya, Russia. Some of the action scenes were shot in Bangkok, including stunts in which Sachin Joshi jumped from a 55-storey tower. See, Azan uh, basically is a journey uh, of one man uh, who's guilty and who needs to find about his brother. And he needs to go beyond the enemy lines to understand uh, more about what is the terrorist, uh, terrorism world is doing against the country. 
Dubai. It's my second time here. I always love coming here. It's, you know, you never know what to expect when you come to Dubai because it's ever changing and there's so many things going on here and so many things to do. Uh, I'm very sad that I'm here for such a short time. I love Dubai. What do I think about Dubai? I think Dubai is fab. The infrastructure, the people, the uh, the politeness, the the knowledge. I, I love Dubai. Uh, you know, if I could, if I could base myself here, I would do so in a heartbeat. I really like this um, city, Dubai. I have a lot of friends here who've been living here for the last five, seven years. Uh, we often come here because it's so close to uh, Mumbai. You know, just two and a half hours away. Uh, we come here to party, and uh, the food is amazing. All kinds of world cuisine. Dubai is a lovely city. Uh, Dubai is uh, is a city which is a great mix of the east and the west. There is tradition. There is culture. There is modern. Modernity. Uh, some of the uh, you know the uh, architecture is uh, fantastic. The Burj Khalifa is absolutely uh, one of the wonders of the world in my view. Uh, the transport, uh, you know, the law and order. I think it all uh, makes for a wonderful city. I love Dubai. Whenever I've come here, people have shown a lot of love to me. I love Dubai. Some of our Facebook fans were invited for the world premiere of Azan. If you would fancy rubbing shoulders with the stars, then join our Facebook fan page and you never know when you would be walking the red carpet with them. That's all we have on our show tonight. Come back next week for another roundup of what's hot and what's not. Remember to stay connected via Facebook and Twitter and yes, all our episodes are on YouTube. Once again, happy Eid to everyone. Join me again next week as the festivities never end on High Life Dubai. Milte hain agle hafte isi samay, isi din. Tab tak ke liye ijazat dijiye. Main hu Uma aur aap sab ko shabba khair, good night and God bless. Tonight's episode was filmed at Studio 8, founded by Sara Belhasa. Studio 8 is a luxury boutique bringing together the most respected names in design from Asia and the Middle East. The store has something for everyone and every occasion. Kim Kardashian and you're watching High Life Dubai with Uma.